This video is going to explain how to use a VLOOKUP function. First of all, the VLOOKUP function actually allows you to get a value from a range or a table of sales located in another area of your worksheet or in another area of your workbook. So the VLOOKUP that we're going to be using, our table is located in another location. It's located on the bonus table. So we're going to look this information up here, or we're going to use the information here. Okay? So let's go and get our, our function. Here is VLOOKUP. We'll click on OK. Notice in this particular function, there are four different categories here. So the first thing is to look up value. What is the value? Well, in this exercise, the value is going to be base monthly salary. So I'm going to click here where the $15,000 is. But notice that the information that is in my function is actually the location of the $15,000. So here we have H4. This is what I want to look. I want to find the values here, go to the table, which is here, and find where the information is. So I'm going to go to my bonus table. I'm going to highlight my table, which is A, A3 all the way down to B8. And then if you notice, this particular table has two columns. This is column one, and this is column two. So now I'm going to go down to my column uh, index number, place the number two here, and I already have my number. I'm going to leave the lookup range blank, but as you can see, as you, as you see the function here, it is already calculated what it should be. So now I'm going to click on OK. Now I'm not through because when I copy the when I copy this, it's going to change because the functions here, the um, lo the cell location or the cell references are actually relative. I need to make them absolute. And to make them absolute, you always have to put a dollar sign in front of the column and then a dollar sign in front of the row. So I'm doing it on, on both ranges. Dollar sign in front of the column, dollar sign before the row. And now I'm going to press enter. Of course the information is going to be the same, but when I copy it, it is actually going to calculate correctly. So this information is here correctly. If I click on the percent sign, you can see that it's dealing with 1%, 2%, 3%, and so on. But this is how to use VLOOKUP. Now, HLOOKUP is just the same. VLOOKUP means vertical lookup. HLOOKUP means horizontal lookup. It's the same idea, except one is vertical and the other one is horizontal. I hope this helps.